Hello everyone, welcome to Efficient User. In today's video, we are going to see about external terminals. Actually, I am a big fan of an uh, integrated terminal which is available uh, inside the uh, VS Code. Here uh, we can able to see the integrated terminal. For some reasons, uh, <coughs> I will be using external terminals. For example, if I want to run custom commands, uh, do some uh, cache uh, maintenance, those kind of things, I will use external command, uh, command prompt. This uh, external terminal is actually like uh, uh, configurable. If you want to use a, a default uh, Windows command prompt, we can able to use. Otherwise, if you want to use a, a Git bash, uh, we can able to use that as well. Let me show you how we can uh, do that. For that, uh, we need command palette. We can able to switch to the command palette right here. I'm going to open the settings page. In the settings, uh, I'm going to search for external terminal settings. I'll just uh, close this. Here uh, we can able to see uh, for Linux uh, what the default settings uh, correct VS Code is having. Here is uh, Windows settings. Right now it is point to command prompt. I'm just going to replace this with something else. Before that, I'll show how external terminal will works. For example, uh, you are working on some project and it has been opened in VS Code. You want to open an external terminal right from the VS Code. All you have to do is click Control plus shift plus c it is control shift c it will open the terminal so right now it is a command prompt of the default windows thing i am going to change it to git bash we don't have to actually save the settings because uh, when you are pasting the text right away it will affect and uh, take the latest one if i click control shift c now you can able to see uh, git bash is getting opened for example i wanted to commit the changes instead of using the default git uh, i can able to do right from here so you can able to set your uh, target external terminal as as it is whatever things you needed you can switch to any other uh, third party command prompts as well so try out and uh, leave your feedbacks in the comment section Keep supporting and uh, make sure you subscribe.